Korea issued an arrest warrant for Do Kwon on September 14, 2022. So what does that mean exactly? And will that inf affect the price of Tarot Luna Classic? Well, let's get into this and have a look. First of all, let's go over what an arrest warrant exactly is. Because it's rumored that Do Kwon is still in Singapore, but that could be that could be changing real quick. So essentially an arrest warrant is a statement that reasonable grounds, reasonable grounds exist to believe that a particular person has committed an offense and that person should come before the court that issued the warrant. And obviously Do Kwon has not exactly went back to South Korea. In fact, we have news here stating that he may, he actually may have left Singapore. He may have left Singapore because the Singapore police said he was no longer in the country and Do Kwon is denying being on the run he's denying it so we're guessing he's not in South Korea otherwise they'd know it Singapore police are saying he's not here either but on Twitter Do Kwon is saying this and he posted this September 17th yesterday so I am not on the run or anything similar any government agency that has shown interest to communicate we are in full cooperation and we don't have anything to hide also he said we are in the process of defending ourselves in multiple jurisdictions we have held ourselves to an an extremely high bar of integrity and look forward to clarifying the truth over the next few months over the next few months so what does that even mean well i'm also hearing that the uh south korea may cancel his passport and if so that would mean he'd have to rush back to south korea quite quickly i think within 14 days is he in south korea i don't know i don't know it, could he be traveling around using somebody else's passport probably unlikely but he's still communicating on twitter or at least somebody is under his name i don't know i don't know what to trust anymore in general there's a an arrest warrant out you should go back to to where where the offense uh to the country or where, where the offense was committed and i don't think he's done that i just don't think he's done that and and he's denying being on the run so which is it if you're not going back voluntarily i'm sorry but you might be on the run all right let's go over to the price of Terra luna classic has this affected it i was hoping that when we have no quan no uh news and it's kind of bad for him in the past people have gotten excited and gotten into Terra luna classic so since he said he's not on the run it really didn't have that much effect on the price in fact in fact it came down to close lower than it opened yesterday so we're kind of treading water right about here at the 29 mark and volumes are very very low so it's just kind of holding holding its breath waiting to see what will happen next tomorrow's a new day monday the stock market's open maybe bitcoin ethereum might pick up and if so it could bring this up too with it but in the meantime i think we just have to kind of wait bitcoin is going down too today so yeah i think it's gonna be a waiting game hey guys that's all i have for you not financial advice please hit that subscribe hit that like and i'll catch you guys in my next video thanks for watching bye